Hello precious one, welcome back once again to my channel. If you are new, I'm Nanabnaya. Today I'm going to share with you how I dissolve Recanilis Organic African Black Soap to wash my hair and also the one I place it in a container to use to bath. The one I'm about to use to bath is the one I have placed in this container. I mix a little bit of sea salt and I will add a little bit of water so all the sea salt will melt the next day. It was not the rock sea salt, it was rather the grind sea salt. And this is the one I use for my hair. For the one I use for my hair, I always place it in a lot of water in a bottle so I will take some parts of the African black soup that is my brand the Rekalele and then roll it like a cucumber shape or a long toffee shape and place it in the water you can use any flax or any container of your desire this is a used water bottle so I place in three rolled one and i'm going to add more water and cover it for the next day the next morning that is it the next morning i'm going to wash my hair you know this is actually natural hair comb roll braided i braided this hair a long time ago a month ago I always put wig on it so before I braid my hair I decided to wipe my face with apple cider vinegar uh, apple cider vinegar I don't use it every day I use it once a week just to clear my face and it helps the pimples also to go away and that is the apple cider vinegar and this is ama oil since it has been one month and i have not even combed my hair for a long time so i need something with a little bit of mint peppermint in it i don't know whether there is peppermint in this one but it it says like peppermint is in it it's very hot be careful with your eyes so i'm going to use it to massage my hair yeah that is early in the morning it's really at dawn i wake up to do this and that is my hair i've not combed it for six good months whenever i wash it i don't comb it and braid it so today i have i have two days off from work and i've decided to wash this hair and then detangle it so as you can see even when i use my hand to part it it can't part it because it is no so i apply the amma oil under my roots and then try as much as possible to massage it through the hair and then i apply one more amma oil the one i pour on the plate and then under my roots and massage it and I try to bring it the, to the ends of the hair. Have you seen the way my hair is pulling? Yes, it is when you don't comb your hair, that is how your hair is going to pull. So I am still detangling it little by little, it's not easy. You see, the oil has started coming to the side of my eye and it's a little bit hot. So, my eye is like I want to cry. And this is how my hair has become because I don't comb it. So, I'm trying my best to detangle it, but it's not easy for me. See the ends? It needs to be cut as well. But I don't have the time to cut the ends this time maybe another time so i'm going to detangle it so it took me long time it took me like three minutes to detangle only that side 
that side it took me three minutes so imagine the rest of the hair imagine the rest it's also going to take me more minutes to detangle it so i think you need to comb your hair anytime you wash it try as much as possible to comb it so after detangle detangling it i add more ama oil and i'm going to twist it out and then push it inside the root and i'm going to do the rest and i will be back because this will take a long time and i have detangled my hair in other videos before you can check some of my old videos so after detangling it this is how it looks like and i'm going to cover it with a plastic cap plastic shower cap and i will leave this for about an hour to do other things so this is how much my hair pull during the detangle have you seen it this is no good always cook your hair so i'm going to cover my hair i'm going to wrap my hair my head with old towel and then this is how it so this is after an hour i'm about to moisturize my hair with the soap we need the recan lily organic black soap that we placed in this water yesterday and the down is the sum of the salt that is in the down the particles in the this thing you see the salt has melted yeah that is the one i'm going to use for shower and the liquid one is also for washing my hair so i always strain or i pour some of the liquid the organic black soap liquid i made into this bottle i bought this bottle a long time ago i used for my hair all right where i bought it below and also i pour half of it into that bottle and i'm going to keep the rest still in that bottle and later on i will throw the under away because it is the particles from the african black soap so that is the lid of the container it's very nice you can use oil in it anything you want to place in your hair in it just cut the lead little bigger and you are ready to go so i'm going to start from my root my root and then through the root i will massage it or moisturize it in the middle and then to the ends so in the root i place in or pour in little bit of the african black soap liquid and then massage it with my fingers a bit and then massage it and i'm going to use this hair massager this hair massager massage the hair and your head at the same time so you get two things it really massage the head and also the hair it helps to take the dirt under the hair away and it also it massage your head i mean your brain it helps the brain to relax when you use that head or hair massager or head brush so anytime a product is good for my hair it is easily for my hair to quickly turn into curly that is the type of hair i have if the product is not good my hair will never be a curly type so this my recalily african black soap liquid i diluted it is so good for my hair i have used this product ever since i cut my hair in fact it was the main reason why i cut my hair and here so now i'm going to twist it and then push it under the root and i'm going to repeat the same thing till i finish all of them so after repeating the same process on the other part then i'm going to wash it and i'll be back so this is after washing 
I'm going to use Recalili Organic Shea Butter. This shea butter is so good for your hair. It is the Recalili product I've used for my hair ever since I shaved my hair. And it has helped my hair to grow healthy all the time. So I apply some of the Recalili Organic Shea Butter on my hair. So that is the shea butter. I take little part and rub it in my hand and then just to apply on my hair. Have you seen how my hair has grown beautifully? I shaved my hair not long ago, so I'm going to braid my hair. And you have seen me braiding my hair a lot, many, many times. This particular hair, so I, I have the video on my Instagram, you can go and check. And yeah, I parted the hair into four sections and I'm going to braid it. And because I'm going to braid it, so I change the part, how I part it, and I'm going to part it in this way so I can start braiding. So I'm not going to show all, I'm not going to show how I'm going to braid this hair because I have full video on my Instagram. Go and check it, my Instagram, Manabnayan. So see you after braiding this hair. I will show you a little bit of it even when. I was outside my forgotten baby. So this is the hair I braided. It's so cute. I'm going to style it, okay, and show you on that day. Ooh, I'm so happy I can do things for myself. I'm proud of myself. Okay. Mm. The first Noel, the angel did say, was to certain poor shepherds in fear.